Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Life is Strange True Colors. I am just finishing the first episode here. It is currently rendering on my PC and I just couldn't help myself but to continue the story and move on into the next video so to say. So another hour of Life is Strange True Colors. I don't know what your reactions are just yet but hopefully I'll see them before the next episode. So let's move on with more of Life is Strange True Colors. Last time out of course we saw Alex. Uh, we read a bit of her backstory through the texts on her phone. Also uh, we sort of got integrated into this new community in Haven Springs, Colorado uh, with our new uh, acquaintance um ryan and steph and all these people that we've met and then of course the brother gabe uh so yeah we'll see how this continues we do know she has some kind of superpower that people are calling it an issue but in reality i think it's just her superpowers which is something similar to that marvel character i i forgot to research this so let me just i said she was lantern or something but her real character name is the mantis of course we'll see how this progresses how this story continues so let's move on without further ado with life is strange true colors please be sure to subscribe like this video if you're enjoying grab a popcorn right now grab snacks grab her drinks and let's move on to life is strange true colors part two all right, so we left off last time out right here, right in her room after she was saying she's okay. And after that huge bust up between uh, Gabe and Mac, who seems like an over obsessive boyfriend of the flower shop owner or the uh, flower shop girl. So let's take a look at our phone for a moment. Yeah, Leith Flowers or something like that. Calling volunteers to help with this year's spring festival. The sign up sheet is on the east side of the Leith Flowers. Swing by to see what roles are available. Okay, maybe we can help out too. Uh, Charlotte, of course, is our uh, brother, Gabe's love interest. I choose to believe this isn't about me. Enough with all the transplants moving here. I don't care if it's good for the economy. I miss Haven the way it used to be. It'd be fine if any of them knew how to drive. Wow. Um, especially in the snow or at night say mike if i remember right you yourself came out here from jersey a couple years ago yeah and i know uh and look how down here everything's gone since then owned self mike lawler could be a joke on my collar i, I don't know see why gabe fits in so well here free drinks tonight at the black lantern to celebrate my sister's arrival what the heck is wrong with you kid there are there most certainly are not it's too late it's already been posted on the internet get ten lit for free just try it can not confirm alex is great can't confirm how she turned out so well and you turned out so you <laughs> it's a nature nurture thing all right cool well that's that let's take a look at the sms's flowing in all right ryan Hi Alex, this is Ryan. It was really nice meeting you at the record store. Looking forward to talking more later. Cool. We've opened up that. Hey Alex, it's Steph. Sorry I had to run out like a crazy person. Excited to meet you for real in the lantern tonight. So there seems to be a get together. Oh, we can get memories. Interesting. And the journal, of course. Uh, we got to open our bag, but let me just... Yeah, let's just check everything first. So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview and Mac thought they were sleeping together. This is fucking stupid. Yeah, I was going to say, Mac is too obsessive. Um, I mean, surely, you know, women and men are going to have a working relationship or a very friendly relationship. But that doesn't breach that boundary of uh, boyfriend, girlfriend or like a love interest, you know. Ms. Lee, your application for CIT's 2019 summer programming launch pad has been reviewed and we are pleased to inform you that you have been selected to move forward to the interview stage. That is why she was so nervous about it. Someone from admissions will be in touch in the next next several days to schedule your interview. Gabe, ah, it's happening. Please, please, please help me prep. Nice. Uh, hold right button when the aura icon displays to see the emotions attached to the object. Oh, so it's not only human emotion but right i'm telling you his story doesn't add up he wants you huh. he's helping me get into college baby you know dudes can do nice things without the expectation of getting laid precisely right? my point a high school dropout a guy who went to fucking juvie wants to be your study buddy 
What, out of the goodness of his heart? Oh my god, Mac, we're friends. There is nothing going on between Gabe and me. Yeah, okay. Mac is an overly obsessive boyfriend. Alright. There's a file on Alex. Alex. Do I want to know? Or do I have a choice of looking or... Ah, uh, she's looking either way. I, I had no choice. Kind of gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Um, Oregon Department of Human Services Child Welfare Offices. Uh, Loretta Vance, Program Manager, Child Welfare. Tri Program Director, Amy Ant. Okay, unable to release location. Uh, Alex placed at group home in Portland area, helping hands group home. So he's been searching for Alex. Anita and Eduardo. They were one of the good ones. Anita Morales, okay, um, looking for my sister. Hello, Gabe. Eduardo and I were very happy to hear from you. We are glad to see you are doing so well after all these years. Colorado is very far away. Sadly, it was difficult to keep talking with Alex after she was taken into the system, and we don't know where she lives now. Here's the phone number for the agency. Maybe they can help Oregon Child Protective Services. Okay, so that's the other person uh, line only available third wednesday of month try human services child welfare we wish you luck in finding her the morales oh, gabe's been looking for me for a while oh so her name is alex chen got through not her nope a dude automated voicemail follow-up old number no do some dude named adam uh okay so he's been searching for alex interesting 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 i think this power of hers is quite new as well i hope we learn more about it soon um interacted with the letter anything in the kitchen let's take a look at the magnet straight from your local record store because how fucking cool is that this I is i held it together in front of ryan and steph yeah steph and ryan's place right the radio oh there's a photo can i interact with that Whoa. please Looks like Ryan turned my brother into a model citizen. Hmm. So Gabe got a new life here, I guess, in Haven Springs. Very nice. People deserve a second chance, and uh, second chances are rare to find these days. Let's take a look at the books. Gabe brushing up on comics and art. Really going the extra mile for Ethan and Charlotte. Nice. Let's Holy see. shit. It looks like Gabe actually read this. The spacious embrace, responsibly parenting your independent child. So Charlotte gave this to Gabe, I guess, because he's going to become a dad, I guess. Must be Ethan's. Wonder how many times Gabe's <laughs> been forced to play. Dino Racer 2. Corythosaurus Cup. Interesting. Huh. Oh, really Son of Lead. the art style since I read these. That's, uh... Jason Voorhees, or a homage to Jason Voorhees. Wait, what? Is that a real live dead deer? Is that supposed to reference Life is Strange 1? Quite possibly. Ah, uh, foosball champ champion. Huh, interesting. Uh, I guess that's the cup or like the champagne turntable. Oh, I guess I can. Get to finish the song. Yeah, sadly. It was also very awkward because it was copyrighted and I turned off copyrighted music. So they were just <laughs> dancing around in nothing. A sword? Okay. There's no emotion attached to that one. I think we're almost there. Almost there, guys. We're going to take a look okay, at the bike. I always wanted a bike like this. Oh, there's a crack in the wall. Oh, there we go. But it looks like Mr. John Shin lives in Miguel County about six months after his arrival. Yeah, is, is there like a forwarding address on file? I'm sorry, sir. That's not information we retain. Thanks again for calling the San Miguel County Clerk's Office. Have a pleasant afternoon. No, 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 no. Hey, don't. <sighs> oh, so he kicked the wall in frustration trying to find Alex. Greetings from Mexico. Looks like we've both had people trying to help us. I'm Ooh. glad it made a difference for Gabe. Len. 
Gabe, got your letter yesterday. I'm doing just fine. If you ever need a reset, come down this way because holy smokes, the food is great and the drinks are even better. I'll never get tired of hearing how great things are going for you. Some days I think about our first meeting at the detention center. Sure, you told me to F off three times, but I'd never seen anyone listen so intently to every word I said. I knew right then that you'd outplay the hand you were dealt point is you are the best kid i ever mentored don't forget it let me know how it goes with alex hope you can find her hmm okay noise whoever this len is took great care of gabe oh can we play we can play this okay you know what sorry i cut you off there gabe is on the leaderboard okay so up down left right space to jump okay Let's just play. Okay, 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 okay. Wait. Oh. Cancel. There we go. Where am I? Okay, there I am. Oh. This is cool. Oh, go down. Oh, God. Oh, ghost is coming. Oh god. Go up, go up, go up. Ghost is coming after us. There's two ghosts now. Oh god. Oh. Oh no. I'm getting stuck. Ah, darn it. One life gone. One miner down. I made a mistake. Okay, this is just like Pac-Man on steroids. Okay. So we know that... Oh god. There we go. We got it now. Go down, go down. There's another ghost that's gonna spawn downstairs. Does that kill a ghost? I don't know. There we go, we got an elevator. Oh, we're on 5,000 points now. Oh, it's a bonus if we don't get killed, I guess. Let's go, let's go, let's go quickly. Another ghost is definitely gonna spawn. Just go down, please. Thank you. Oh dear. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, you can kill ghosts with that light. Nice. Just as I expected. This was a straightforward one. There we go. We're down. Oh, there are minecarts now. We might die if we crash into it, I'm assuming. Okay. Ah! Oh, I missed it. Oh, you die. Of course. Too high. Man, Gabe's good at this, isn't he? Nice. I'm trying to kill the ghost quickly. Nice. Killed him. Oh, you die from there too? Wow. I didn't think that was too much of a high distance difference. But anyway, let's go down to the bottom floor. Is the ghost coming to the bottom floor? No, he's not. Okay, bye. Last life. Bye. I'm on 15,000. Let's go. I'm a gamer. Oh god. Okay, whoo. Good jumps, good jumps. Ah, oh, darn it. Nice try though. 16,000. I think. Oh, I'm not even on the leaderboard. That's how bad I was. Anyway, that's fine. That was a good little Easter egg. Uh, good Looks little like fits right game. In. Uh, spring sesquicentennial celebration. Oh yeah, that's 150 years, isn't it? Nice. Board game. Let's take oh, a look. Man. Gabe used to crush me. Oopsies. Jerk. Is that a... Oh, there's a postcard. Did I look at that? Yeah, we did. The Mexico. Can I go upstairs? No, I cannot. Not yet, at least. Alright, time to open our bag, finally. Sorry for the long wait, guys. But we did explore everything, and that's one important thing about these games. You have to explore everything. 
Oh, I didn't go to the dresser in the photo. Oh god. She's <laughs> gonna look so grungy on this nice bed. Aww. She's Cute though. She's me through some hard times, but... I was hoping we were done with that. Okay, hold on. Before we continue... We're gonna take a look at this no photo. Way. Gabe has this photo too? Look at our parents. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole. Family photo. Interesting. Oh, we can change clothes. Hold up a sec. I did get an extension because I ordered it deluxe. So I think I have other clothes. Whoa, that's nice. Different colors. Colorado. All right, remind me not to change clothes because that just crashed the game. Let's take a look what at the medals. We missed the this. Sister of the Rubber Duck Derby second place finisher. Okay, so these are some medals. Interesting medals. And we have a sculpture. Charlotte made this? Gabe mentioned she was an artist, but I didn't realize he meant, like, professionally. Very I good art. never make something so... Modern day. Personal. Anywho, let's take a look at the ceiling. Anything? Nope. Um, we checked everything else. I don't know if any of them had consequences. So, for example, the... Uh, the letter, checking the emotional quality of it or contents of it, had uh, had significance to the story as well as the crack. Uh, anything else? Nah. I think the only ones that really matter are the ones that you can emotionally interact with um, regarding an object. So let's unlock Shoo Shoo. Of course, you saw that earlier, but game crashed, so we're back here. Shoo Shoo's gonna look so grungy on this nice bed. She's gotten me through some hard times, but I was hoping we were done with that. All right, let's unpack the comic. Oh yeah, that's the comic of the of Ethan. Ethan's really talented. Makes sense that his mom's an artist. Let's read this. Uh, the tunnel to the monster stronghold of Demonheim collapsed. I'll have to find another way in. The uniform of the city guard, long dead from the looks of it. Blood? The trail seems to end here, unless... Hollow. Aha, he must have crawled through here. The corpse of a cloud serpent, it must have crashed through the ceiling. Perhaps if I can reach higher ground, I can find the secret entrance. Our flying days are over, Cloud Serpent, but you may still be of use to me. That glow beyond the peak, that must be the Stronghold's back gate. Interesting. So this is another installment of his series, I guess. Very cool. Um, look. We've seen things, haven't we, Shoo Shoo? Such a cute little plushie. Unpack letters. So I guess one by one we're getting introduced to other elements of the story. Gotta read the letters, man. Gotta read the letters. Gotta figure out what's happened to our protagonist here. Let's take a look at the letters. I never heard back from Sydney. I hope she's okay. Hey Alex, what's up? You still at Helping Hands? Just so you know, I'm going to delete my account and lay low for a while. I hooked up with this asshole a couple times for a place to stay and now he's harassing me. So, uh, also, I'm leaving Burnside. The super supervisors <laughs> are racist and keeps accusing me of dealing. I'll hit you up if I find a new situation. Honestly, I'm running out of options, but you know me. I'll get creative anyway. Hope you're good. Is Lauren still there? Remember when you effed her up, lol. Miss your dumbass, Sydney. At least she cared. More than I can say for most. Okay. Dear Alex, I wouldn't blame you if you threw this letter out before even opening it. If you're reading this, thank you for giving me a chance to apologize. I wasn't ready. I wasn't cut out for being a foster parent. The stress, the arguments, the shouting. It was too much for me, especially at my age. I should have known better. I'm sorry if I made things worse for you. Good luck out there, Miss August. I shall see. Oh. The rare bright spot from my time in the group home. One back, please. I double pressed by accident. Okay. Alex Chen, patient name. Date, of course, 
in weird letters because that's how doctors write address i don't know new something uh, alprazol er okay sure it's a prescription uh dear alex happy birthday here's hoping you're having an absolutely fabulous day and that you don't have to deal with a single uh thing from sun up to sundown real talk though i want to thank you for all the things you've done for me since we met i felt safe and happy and even loved when you're around pretty unusual for people like us right anyway thank you for being you uh for being my friend for the way you beat harley's ass for letting me wear all your clothes even when i don't ask i don't want to sound like a loser but you're basically the only good thing in here chelsea she's also the girl from our texts so very important friend unpack photo i mean you have an awfully big bag there it's like a never-ending bag oh she cut off her parents crazy how much we've changed so that's gabe i'm assuming and this is alex and then in that photo in the other photo that was uh mom and dad where are you gonna put that photo i mean there's already another copy of it right there Maybe overlap it, right? No way. We already interacted with it. Oh, wait, we didn't because um, this is a load. Guess Gabe didn't cut out our parents. How mature. Look at them. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole. Okay, so I guess if we interacted with it earlier, like we did before, this cutscene might be tad different, maybe? I don't know. But there we are. Cool, cool. My journal. Time to add my latest meltdown. So Mac was reading Riley's text, boyfriend of the year. Okay, so we're getting introduced to everything that we missed because I didn't check it earlier. Due to the game loading. A previous save, not the one that I had mid-session. Mac and Anger. Um, it all started with a knock. I think I felt something off before Gabe even opened the door, like something was slipping under the frame. Something red, something raw, then there's Mac. Uh, okay. I'm going to pause it here. You guys can literally read this on your own because I think this is a song. Yep. Because this is all the other stuff. I read it usually when I am um, editing. So, yeah, that's that. We have a phone message. Oh, yeah, earlier we didn't check these, so we're just going to press some check that and then my block of course we read that I'm gonna choose to believe this isn't about me yep we read that and then I we read that Gabe fits in so well here cool cool Ugh. I'll finish this later that bag is never getting opened, by the way. That bag is staying closed forever. Oh, there's something else in there. Oh, a guitar case. A machine gun. No, just kidding. Oh. No fucking way. Language, Alex. <laughs> Here's a little something to say. Welcome home. Can't wait to hear you shred. Man, and we smacked the dude in the last episode. Poor guy. Is she going to play a song? Maybe. Well, Alex, you just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? Do I have get a choice? It 
It's a copyrighted song again. <laughs> Just silence. Oh goodness. Man, games should really put uncopyrighted music or just buy the claims to it and then just allow us to upload however it is because this is ridiculous. Kind of pulls out of the uh, whole experience, you know. Well, a lot of silence. I'm just going to take this moment and just talk to you guys for once. How are you? <laughs> How are you? Like, seriously. Let me know in the comment section down below how you feel right now. What you guys think of the series. How you guys are. Would love to interact with you guys. It's all about emotion and expressing emotion. So hopefully you guys have your outlets. Be it music, writing, poetry, art. Screaming into a, you know, into a bag. Or something, I don't know. Playing an instrument. Man, I'm missing out on a lot with this silence. I wonder what she's singing about. All right. Okay, I think she finished singing. It's almost 4.25 in the back. You and your damn surprises, Gabe. Act like you've never seen it before. Be true. I'm not gonna let anything mess it up. Yeah, hide the thing again. Act like you never saw it. I should go downstairs and set things right with Gabe. Indeed. But let me just quickly Looks like go through this. Trying to help us. I'm glad it made a difference for Gabe. Okay, we read everything here. Um, I'm just gonna quickly like fits right in. interact with everything in case it becomes something important oh, later on. Okay. All right, done interacting with everything. Let's go downstairs through the door, make things right with our brother Gabe. Let's see what's next. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. <laughs> so, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. I don't need to go. Oh, Ryan knows what he's doing. Now you just go with him. Nice people. Kind. Alex. I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Now there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. I'm my tending bar. <laughs> I love that. Falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So, what's it doing today? Aw, oh, don't tell- Aw, oh, God. Do I know? Rising, falling. Falling. It's kind of a bad day, isn't it? I don't know. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I- Oh, it has consequences, really? Everything has a consequence. A so far. I can't imagine. Do, 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 do. I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. Maybe. Cooler than Gabe? But does he think I'm cooler than Gabe? I'd say you have a shot. Gabe plays dirty, though. 
Like he secretly teaches Ethan to swear. Ooh. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. Jed, you didn't have to. Now Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my hmm. watch. That's the good thing about a smaller town. They I take care of each other. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival and they have to be done tonight. Sorry I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah. Hey. Same. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Perfect time. Yep. Do, do, do. Music's nice in the background. Some indie music, I guess. Because these guys love their indie music. Oh boy, there's Mac. Obsessive boyfriend. That's what we're going to call him. Obsessive boyfriend. Do we get to explore this place? Oh, there's Steph. Doom, 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 doom. So I'm short staffed at the moment. I'm tenting bar. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. Do 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 do. Couple years experience as a server. Uh. Um. Ooh, do we go clean or? Oh, this is hard. I say let's open the book. Come clean. You always want to leave the book open. Keeps full of shit. I've never worked in a restaurant before. Never stops that one. But I would love the work if experience isn't an issue. Want to give it a try? It's not too busy right now, and we keep it informal around here. Okay. Let's do it. Thanks. Being honest All is always right. good. So we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. All right. Steph over here. All right. Uh, there's a table in the back that needs clearing also. Ah, uh, next to get Mac. Food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right. Copy that. That should be it's easy. Really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. Oh, they're so kind. All these kind people. I guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Uh, objectives. Okay, check on Duck and Dan. Diane, check on Steph and clear the table in the back. Okay, the table in the back is definitely going to cause some issues. So let's talk to Duck and Diane. I should check on that table. Um, Duck, of course, is the guy. Ducky is the guy who's writing on social media instead of Googling stuff last Can time. Can I get you two anything? Miss Chan, here at last to relieve our suspense. Hmm. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister. The third, Ducky, to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired, and this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to hmm. meet you. Looks very similar to Riley. That, uh, that we all knew you were coming. Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. Guy's a bit of a loud mouth. You're from Portland, right? <laughs> I moved here from D.C. six months ago. Hey. How are you finding the small town thing? Um, kind of perfect, to be honest. I didn't really know what to expect, but it's kind of perfect. <laughs> it feels like a home. I know, I know. I really thought I would hate it. Then I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. The I'm badge. glad there's another newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. Oh, no, don't tell me. My dad was in the service. Okay. Speak. Hey, Jed. Yeah. I've got an order. Oh, no, don't tell me. Diane. Go ahead. I have to recite it. Burger with mushrooms. One burger with mushrooms. Uh huh. And? Pie special with fries. One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yes. Yeah, he did. Oh, I and think I got it. Of a particular rye whiskey. Rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. I can be a server, guys. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. 
Hmm. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Hmm. Serves him right if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Is there a time limit to when I have to check oh, in with the others? If you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. Alright. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Let's... Oh. Some good aura. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Okay. Oops. Okay, only her. I think I could read this. Oh, first aid kit. Wow. Tetanus anyone? <laughs> I hope Ryan's got better supplies. All right. Let's Damn boys, always fighting. Time to grow up. Should have seen Gabe go at it with Dad. Oof. He's come a long way. Ivan's not a bad company. Oh, the family photo. Really Ryan? Oh, spring 2000. That's 19 years ago. Once you get used to how they operate. You minor? Right. Yeah, yeah, starting over from scratch like this. Fucking terrifying is what it is. You're Interesting. Me. Oh, ballot notice? Yeah, I guess. An official council meeting will be held on the 26th of May to decide one measure. This measure pro proposes selling property of no more than 20 acres to Typhon Mining for use in an open pit mine. Both the sale profit and subsequent property taxes will be added to the overall budget of Haven Springs to be divided and spent through standard procedure. More information is available at Town Hall. Talk to a council member if you have any further questions or concerns. Interesting. My extensive wilderness map reading knowledge tells me that there is a whole lot of wilderness around here. Okay, Haven Springs is surrounding wilderness. I guess this is Haven Springs. For rattlesnake shots, see Jed Lucan. For rattlesnake bites, see Ryan Lucan. Okay. Backcountry scheme by permit only. Trail maps available at so, the ranger station. Let's take a look at the notice. For the chance to get mauled by a bear. Fish and Big Game Hunting, 2019 Haven Springs Quick Guide. Notice resident license fees have changed. Okay. Youth license is available. Wow. That looks radioactive. Yeah, looks like absinthe to me. That's the girl from the record store. Staff. Okay, so let's check on her. Alex, right? I'm Steph. What hey. up? Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks so. though. Alright. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though if you want to chat. I'm working. <laughs> got no time for you. Um. What are you working on? Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no. It's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? I don't know. Um, I think she knew, no? At the record store. Sure. Live action role play, right? Fantasy fighting in real life? Yep. There we go. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Interesting. Would you ever want to join us sometime? Is that... Sure, I'd give it a try. Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Uh, I guess we can ask about everything. Is that your shot? Absinthe. What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. Wow. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. Huh, cool. Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? Ooh, you're on. Let's do it. Dude, you're on. Uh, my yes. knowledge of music is absolute nonsense. Like it's in existence, but. So, I'll pick a song. You have five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. okay. 
Hey. Please don't be. Ah, it's probably copyrighted. It's gonna be silent. Got one. Jukebox is all yours. So, what do you want to ask me? Oh, it's one. Hmm. I don't know. I should flip through these and see what might be good to ask. So, scroll through albums. We got balloon. Balloon people. Um, excuse me. Oh, I can't. Okay. Song missing. Think of the children. Vic Nasty. Uh, blame the monkey brain. Pyrrhic or Pyrrhic. Check and raise. Mind the damn porridge. Endurance for electronics. Endur okay. Joralamon, G line transfer. Okay. Gramps McGovern, give me a hand and kick your own ass. Seward's Folly, go, Dotty, go. Ah, uh, Sandra Styles, Heartstrings. Vermillionaire, Hero with a Thousand Rhymes. The F. Adelix. Kiss up and shut me. Fusky and Wags. Mildred Cross and the Watermelon Floss Bridge. The Who Knows. Mrs. Beatrix and I. The Theodosius. Ordinary Judas, right? Yeah. Uh, Panoramic Panoramica. I was saying Boo Urns. There are so many. Tommy Tiger and the Tummy Tuggers. Huh. Cold cocked. Should have been me yesterday. McFadden, unf yourself. Doc Scruffin. Words, hands. Okay, that's it. Um. I think one way to get rid of most of these is going to ask about the cover. If there's a human. Cover art. People on the there cover. Are people on the cover. No. Okay. So yeah, any. No. Okay. So anything without a human in it. Okay. Does that count as a human? I don't think. <sighs> Maybe. Song missing. Think of the children. Is that's an ape, isn't it? That's an X-ray of an ape. Blame the monkey brain, obviously. That's not it. Does it have people on the cover? No. So that means. Animals, animals. Let's see. So that's an animatronic. That's food and a rat. That's a human. That's a human. That's a human. That's a human. That's a tree in a maze. That's some um, psychedelic looking kaleidoscope image. Humans. Armadillo. Humans, for sure. Is that a human? Because that is technically a human in a tiger costume. Ants and a shoe. Narwhal and a... Okay, so these two aren't it either. So they're animals. Um, who should have been me yesterday? What are some song title questions? Ooh, punctuation. Okay, that's gonna be interesting. Are there any punctuation marks in most of these? Okay. Doesn't seem like there's any punctuation in the ones that don't have a human in them. Yeah. That'll be a stupid choice. Um, four words or more. Possibly. Four words and more. Might be a good one. Let's ask. Does the song have a long title? Like four words or more? Yes. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Interesting. I knew that was going to be it because there aren't that many. 
So this is an option. Four words or more, yes. Four word, no. So this is out. This one's a yes. This one's a yes. This one's a no. Four words or more. Two, four, five. Yeah, this is a yes. This is a yes. This is a no. This is a no. This is a no. This is a yes. Um, there are no people on the cover. Let's see. Song title questions. Any punctuation title is four words or longer. Curse word. Um, let's see. Yeah, these are none. Uh, curse word. This is a no. Let's see if that is a good question to ask because I doubt it. There aren't that many curse words that I've seen on the ones that we're looking at. It'd be a stupid question to ask. Yeah, there's no f swear words. Okay, so song title is out of the question. We don't need that question. Those are just wasted. Band name questions. Has a person's name. Has a symbol. How many do I have? How many have sim? Okay, yeah, this guy. But I don't know how many of these have a symbol. Hmm, there's two right now. Oh, this one. But that one's out, isn't it? Yeah. One word. This. This is a bit of a risk. One word is a risk. Ooh. Cover art questions. Personal questions. Ah, uh, those personal questions are gonna be a little tricky. Let's ask this one. Is one the word. band name only one word? It is more than one word. Okay, this one's out. More than one word. Two questions left. This one's in, right? Yeah, this one's still in. This one's still in. Wait, band name. More than one word. So this one's still in. This one's still in. This one's still in. This one's still in. I no, this one's out. This one's still in. So I'm down to uh, only a handful now. So this one is in. One. Two. Three. Four. That's it. Five. These are it. I'm down to five. This is very good. We're making good progress with these questions. Um, let's ask this. Has the, is band, the band name, name on the cover? Yep. Ah. Last question. Dang it. Yeah. All right. I know. So this one's in still. This one's in. Hi. Right, this one's out already. So one, two. Three, I may have done a very stupid qu question. So three, this one's out then. It's not on the cover. This one's out too. We're down to three. Okay, we're down to three. That was a decent question then. Not bad. So this one. One. Two, three. These three. Song title was more than four words, right? Um, band name is more than one word. Cover art. There are no people on the cover. Band name is on the cover. Um, I think we have to go personal with the final question because we're down to three. Right? 
Yeah, we're down to three. Yeah, time to get personal. Why do you like this song? So, I guess we're breaking the yes or no questions only Oh, suck, Can shucks. Can handle it? Sorry. So, why do I like this song? The lyrics crack me up. Even the title's pretty goofy. Reminds me of fun times, I guess. Goofy title, you say? Hmm. That's your five. Oh. Uh, Ready to guess? Yeah. That was Let a stupid me move. One last time. Here's what I know. It's not a one-word band name. Mm -hmm. The song title is at least four words long. No people on the cover. The band name is on the cover. The title's kind of goofy. Think that's enough to figure it out? We'll see. Here's what I know. It's not a one-word band name. The song title is at least four words long. No people on the cover. The band name is on the cover. The title's kind of goofy. Okay, I think this one's out. Yeah, okay, I'm down to two then. It's a 50-50 game. This one's out because the title is not goofy. Uh, is it though? It reminds her of fun times. I think this is my guess. Surely. It's a goofy title. Fun times as a child, right? Blame the monkey brain. I think this isn't it. I'm gonna guess this one. Three, two, one. Is it that one? No, it's not. Ah, dang it. Sorry. Bummer. All right. Let her drink me. Dang it. Which one was it? I'm curious. It's not as bad as it looks. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of like Midori now. How was it? Fantastic. <laughs> Why? It's actually delicious. <laughs> you should try one. Jokes <laughs> on you. Hey, thanks for playing. I'm really glad we did. Me too. That was fun. Hang out with Ryan. So, you and Ryan hang out a lot? All the time. Except when he ditches me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. Bros, man. Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Luke and family thing. Yeah. Good to know. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? What is that? It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he saved- I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Sorry, Jed. Ooh, he doesn't like to discuss it. He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Okay. Interesting. I should get back to work. Whoa, what was that jump okay. cut? That was a weird jump cut. There all must right. be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Oh, business card. Thanks for driving me home, Mike. You're the nicest cop I've ever met. Whoa! Hey! Great. Another wipeout. Mike is a funny name. <laughs> like the fish. Officer Fish. <laughs> oh, whoa. Well. Something's weird. Pike is my. S Holy shit! Is it snowing? Yep. Sure is. Oh, I think there's something suspicious about the cop. That was hmm. actually pretty fun. Which song was it then? I want to know. Is it this one? I don't know. This one, surely. No. I don't know. I'll we'll have to look it up on YouTube or something. I got written up for leaving my phone on. It wasn't even on. Damn boys. Oh, I already fighting. Time to throw up. Let's go upstairs quickly before we clean up that final table. 
We need to find the man's rye whiskey. Oh. All right. Let's We're back at I my place. Ducky's whiskey up here. Okay, we still can't go up that final set of staircase. So, um, I think there was a liquor cabinet like up there. I think it's the foosball champion um, bottle. I think surely it is. Ducky's whiskey could be one of those. Yep. Search. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. Really? Really? Gabe's got a pretty fancy collection. No rye whiskey. Okay, where could it be? Couch? If Ducky fell asleep here last night, maybe the bottle's nearby. Maybe on the table that's behind the couch? No, those are vases. <laughs> it's in the couch. Wow. Mockery Hill Straight Rye Whiskey Small Batch 100 Proof. 100 Proof. 100 Proof. Alright, we're good. We got the whiskey. Found this upstairs. In Gabe's couch? <laughs> really? Must have been a night. Many thanks, Alex. Put in a good word. Well, it's my first day working here, so put in a good word for me, okay? <laughs> She's a go-getter. Hey, yo. Can I pour so. you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. Oh, I get a drink too? Yo, I'm going to get lit by the end of my shift. Just had a drink with Steph. Now yes, I'm having Alex a drink Jen, here. A most tenacious detective. I'm going to get Alex. lit. Cheers. Why is that blurred out? Why is the glass blurred out? I don't know. Okay. Um. Okay, only her. Speak. Okay, never mind. My dad was in the service. Good to know. Um. Don't need to go upstairs anymore. There are a bunch of photos to interact with here. This one's from yesterday. Oh, ducky. Guess that's another bottle of something else. This Is that it? From yesterday. That's the only photo we can look at out of like, I don't know how many there are. There are 12. And I can only interact with what? Bullet hole. Plaque. Let's Damn. take a look at the map. I wonder if the bullet's still in there. Here, Jack Henry shot at William Porter over four aces and paid with his life. 1883. Interesting. Rest bullet in hole. Peace. So that's where he shot him, huh? Blasting yes, caps. Uh, blasting caps. Keep dry. High safety squibs. Space heater number two. Highly dangerous match for fast destination. Please use caution and clear area before alighting. 100 count. Huh. Okay. Advertisement. Maybe you'll see a circus one day. Traveling circus. Wild Once beasts. I'm better with crowds. Acrobats. Feats of strength. Restaurant review. Black Lantern. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. A menu of standard pub fare, serviceably uh, prepared with occasional standout specials, is elevated by unusually personable staff. Exceptional service and quirky patrons, creating a uniquely uplifting experience well worth the drive into remote Haven Springs, Colorado. 3.7 on food, 4.2 decor, 4.9 on service. Okay. Not the greatest on the food front, so Jed, you gotta start working Is there more. Anything this woman can't do? Uh, when I met Charlotte Hammond, Harmon in her home studio last month, both her and her coffee mug were covered in paint. Yes, I'm a cliche. She beamed as she led me towards her latest creation, a gorgeous portrait of local business owner Eleanor Leith. Part oil painting, part the curd bouquet. Very few surfaces in our house are free of paint. I'm okay with that. She continued, you're probably familiar with Miss Hammond's work, Harmon's work. Thanks to her commission from the town council to decorate the walking path off Main Street, the massive outdoor mural fittingly titled Haven Springs captures our small slice of earth nestled in the Colorado mountains. It was such a wonderful experience, Miss Harmon recalled. Everyone supported me during the process, and Jed basically fed my family for months, which was great because the lantern makes the best burgers in town. You can print that. 
Now Mrs. Harmon is looking to deepen her connection in, uh, to Har Haven Springs and start a business. No easy task for a working artist. Interesting. Women's room, not interactable. Men's room, not interactable, of course. Um, oh, God. Okay, there's a flyer on the table that I can interact with. Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. Radical acceptance, finding gratitude in the midst of chaos. Okay. Interesting. Um. Ooh, menu. Venison and leek pie. I need to try that. Sorry, Jed. See ya. Alright, we're going to the back table to clear it up. Uh, this is gonna be awkward. Shit. Oh. Now Max scared. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Okay. Can I read him though? Plaque. Yeesh. Glad I'm not a 19th century miner. A tag board used in Teller Mine around 1880. Each miner removed his check tag as he entered the mine and replaced it on the board when he had safely exited. Very cool. So that's to keep uh, everyone in a mining history. Yeah. To to be in account for everyone. To take account of everyone. <laughs> G A B. That's gotta be Gabe, right? Who's who's ASS? <laughs> Automatic uh, sorting system. Uh, look. Jed asked me to clear that off. Yeah, obviously. So let's clear it. I smashed the bottle over his head, Emma. Murder Holy you. Shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? What do you want? Listen. What happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Mainly you. You're an obsessive that is boyfriend. Bullshit. And you know it. I was defending Gabe from you. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. But Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? Um... So, you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No. No, just, like, let me handle it. I mean, sure, I'm busy, I'm working. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Hey, yo. So please, help me out. Look, we're all about peace and love here. Sure. I don't know, man. Sure, sure, Shit. sure. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god, look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Wrong question, woman. Wrong question. Why do you give a shit? Oh dear. Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. We've gotta help a bro out, man. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! <laughs> I'm just awkwardly I, there. <laughs> why you guys are meeting behind my back? The interview. She's okay. gonna spill it, no? So, how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. Okay, um... Not exactly sucker punched, but... He definitely started it. She's catching on. She's catching on. Oh god. Were you there too? <sighs> Avoid further trouble, obviously. 
Oh, ay, ay, ay. Yo, I, I, I am part of this. Avoid further trouble. Yeah, I was there. But, um, I need to get back to work. Sure. Alex, we'll, uh, we'll get out of your way. I can't believe you two. It sounds so childish. Hey, yo. Sorry, I am part of it. It's it's them to deal with. So like, worked up thinking of you with him. Best course of action is to let them deal with it. So. Alex Chen? Uh. So. You were there when your brother assaulted Mac Loudon? Oh. I'm Jason Pike. I. Deputy Sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you and your brother in for questioning. Am I under arrest? Are you saying I'm under arrest? <laughs> Your face. <laughs> Jeez, you guys are running a loose boat around here, aren't you? No, I'm only kidding. Nobody's in trouble here. I, <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. This guy seems like trouble. Guy's gonna use his badge to do some weird stuff. I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. Thanks for being a good sport. Of course. Buy you a drink. Can I do a um, citizen's arrest maybe. on this guy? I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? Yo, everyone's buying me a drink. I'm gonna be lit by the end of the day. Um, award. 19 lives? Jed is a real hero. Service above self, presented with gratitude to Jed Lucan for unflagging courage and outstanding devotion to duty in saving the 19 lives of his team. Wow. Rotary Club of Haven Springs, 2008. Newsletter. It seems pretty serious about this festival. Only two spots left in the baking bread baking competition. There are only two spots remaining in the bread baking competition for this year's spring festival. This year's theme is seeds and nuts. Interested participants should call Isabel ASAP at 555-9002. The grand prize winner last year was Peter Gowers with a garlic asiago loaf. Nice. Typhon Mining Sponsors Raffle for Caribbean Cruise. The Spring Festival will have another raffle this year, and the big prize is a seven-day cruise in the Caribbean. Airfare is included. The prize was donated by Typhon Mining. Raffle proceeds to benefit the Haven Springs Firehouse and the Haven Springs Historical Preservation Society. Tix tickets can be purchased ahead of time at Town Hall or at the festival. Um, sounds awfully fishy. Um... Companies like to do those kind of events to move people. Coupons for weed? What a time to be alive. Recreational and medical. Alright. Cool, cool. They like to do that to move people away from certain areas and then... How mysterious. Uh, ...undermine them and get stuff. So, Amelia Rosam Goldstein. On this site, Amelia Goldstein operated a bed and breakfast for nine years known as its beautiful rooftop garden. She died at the age of 32 of influenza. Though married shortly after, uh, shortly before death, the identity of her husband remains a mystery. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, collage. C. Harmon must be Charlotte. This is really cool. Must be. Very nice drawing. Okay. Nothing else. We got to get back to work. People are leaving their jackets around, but I'm assuming it's them. Don't forget your stuff. All right, I think I've interacted with literally everything in this building, so. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? I guess yes. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Oh, there they are, right on cue. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great, not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? Hey yo, family gotta stick together. To I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. Yo, you gotta work. I it's your shift, isn't it? Today. I was glad to have you. I can see you're a hard worker. I get the good stuff. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. All right. We'll see you tomorrow. Ooh, I get a okay. call back. Time to talk to Gabe. Oh, there's tab for phone. Something happened on my phone. Oh, 
Oh, sunlight. Ooh. Let's be honest. Straightforward. I mean, I don't think it's her type, but... That's your jaw. Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... That's my third drink, by the way. <laughs> what? I... Did you rehearse that move? Did you rehearse that move? No. Only in my mind. <laughs> so... Need a manager? For your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people. <laughs> Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it. Guess I never realized. Which one? I'm a crazy person. That I'm a crazy person? I think that's no, what her come on. tendency has been. I never realized what your life must have been like. On your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about you took him apart like you've done it before didn't you go to you guess we gotta open up more kids in foster care fight a lot I learned how to defend myself I'd say I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? Oh, it's going to be another important. <sighs> Ooh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why is my mouse pushing me more towards tell him about your past? Okay, I'm gonna open up about my power. This is the decision I'm gonna make. That's the direction I wanna go. There's something... off about me I know what other people are feeling I can see these auras around them and if they feel strongly enough if they're angry or sad or afraid I feel it too and then I lose control And this has happened for a long time 
It says March, no? I don't know. Like Mac. I felt all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you, he's angry at himself. He thinks he's gonna lose Riley. Did Riley tell you that? I just feel it. No, no one told me that. I just feel it. The extent of the power. You sure it's not just, you know? It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds or stress or trauma or whatever. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? You need more beer <laughs> or it doesn't work. <laughs> you need more beer. You're feeling like you need a lot more beer. <laughs> That's true most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. Pretty much. I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. Getting beat up and having no friends. That's a super curse, dude. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there. I mean, that's... That's really special. Special? Elaborate, please. Special. That's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? But it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Don't forget that. Hmm. Such a wholesome family moment there. But yeah, the ambiance. Something's bound to happen. I said this in the last episode as well. So, it's a slow burn. What are you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh shit! You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. I oh, should have kept the secret. a secret. Surprise. <laughs> well, what do you think? Um, let's go with the happy. I love one. it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, shed. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? No, Ryan. Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. Oh, he, he was, went to the mine. I haven't seen him in a while. I told him not to wander off. I'll find him. Gabe? Oh, no. Wait. Earlier, when I was talking with Ethan, he told me he was hiking up the mountains to explore the old mine. What? Why didn't you say something? I'm sorry. Kids if code, bro. He actually went up there. We need to move. Now. Okay, let's go. Well... Should I have spilled the beans? I mean, I don't think it makes a difference, or? Ooh, 
what's happening in the dark. It's a quite eerie environment. Ethan? Oh right, he's a park Ethan? ranger, I forgot. Yo, they have oh satellite God, phones? Alex. You're telling me to climb in there? Perhaps. Oh, it's just an opening in the wall. This way. Wow. Been a while since I was up here. They're gonna detonate this place. How worried should we be? Should I be... I don't know... Freaking out right now? In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Yeah, I agree. Any luck? We'll touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Thank the Lord. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey, you good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. Yeah, let's find this guy. Kid, can you imagine the shit we would have caught from dad if we'd done anything like this? Hmm. I should have said something earlier. I didn't. I mean, when he said he was going to the old mine. Alex, it's fine. You couldn't have known. I mean, I pieced oh. together. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's like one plus one. Still, though. Yeah. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. I sure. I can do that. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? All right. Landed a job on my first day. I cited. This fresh start is oh still God. salvageable. Excited to announce we have a new addition to Black Lantern staff. Happy to have you, Alex. Maybe you can teach Gabe a thing or two. Hey, she could teach me way more than two things. She's a good sport. Good. Two hour warning. We'll be detonating charges in two hours. If you're in a marked danger zone, you must begin clearing out now. Call our 24 safety hotli hotline. Excuse me. Poster has disabled replies. Groves hey, Theater. Has an indie movie theater. Impressive. Wow. Which was the best living dead movie, night, day, land, dairy. Come to our Marathon of the Dead and watch them all to the side for yourself. Tickets are $15 online and 22 at the door. Stupid debate. Dawn of the Dead was obviously the best. Have you ever seen Survival of the Dead? Nope, and e neither has anyone else. I don't think Land of the Dead gets enough credit. Let's face it, none of the sequels lived up to Night of the Living Dead. Literally, how dare you? Dear God, what have we done? Yes, I'm have to step up my game. Seeking worthy competition for the jukebox game. The Chen continued to prove no match. Hey now. Oh, shots fired. It was my first game. Oh, she tweeted back. Hey, if you want to keep going, there's plenty more bedazzled. The Kiwi schnapps waiting for you. I had no idea people were drinking that. Should I buy more? No. <laughs> yeah. That's Silver Dragon. Dispensary. She seems cool. Now I've got a love so deep in the pit of my heart is a sheep. <laughs> I don't know. If you're not 21 yet, this post isn't for you. Uh, and each day it grows more and more. Babe, we've talked about this. Boyfriends are not allowed to participate in giveaways. You know, I can't resist the temptations. So is Silver Dragon Charlotte's side job? <laughs> okay, new lyric to finish. Don't hesitate because the world seems cold. Stay young at heart cause because you're never never old earth wind and fire you got it just but uh, show me this post next time you swing by huh interesting lost Ryan dog like a sweet guy 
has run away. She's very sweet. Please, please let me know if you see her. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, hope she gets home safe. Let me know beforehand. Okay. Hector. Okay, is that it? Yep, I've caught up. SMS, Ducky. Dear Alex, it was very much my pleasure meeting you this evening. I hope you find a welcoming home here in Haven. I look very much forward to our next meeting. Sincerely. Thank you, Ducky. That's very sweet. He's writing an old people method. Front door. Cool. A murder barn. Okay. Private property notice. Trespassing. Will we though? The area is a private property of Typhon Mining. Only authorized personnel are permitted. Okay. Violators will be persecuted. Safety poster. Might be interesting. Nope. Nope. Protective headgear. Nope. Sturdy gag. Okay. Super nope. Yep. Nice. Open gate. Maybe Julie McNamara doesn't need your approval. Ooh. Okay, safety poster we checked. Whoa, zombie. How is the rubber zombie the least creepy thing out here? Indeed. Hey bro. Wanna get wasted at the old mine? Ye. Okay. You don't realize until you're up close. But mining equipment is super murdery. The monster here is underage drinking. Looks like it. Oh, mine notice. They were gonna set off charges tonight. Thank God Gabe got a hold of them. Yeah, I mean that was what we read in the city. Can't interact with that door. Perhaps we can interact with this side of the machinery. My joyride in this will have to wait until after we found Ethan. Okay, seems like Ryan and Gabe are waiting for us at the entrance. Wow. Once Ethan's safe, I'll raise one too. Ooh, we raise our drinks to Jed, Luke, and who at this location on December 30th, 2008 pulled us out of hell. Ooh, this is a bad foreshadow. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. Okay. Alex, why? Why didn't you? No point in blaming anyone. We just gotta find him. Fast. Okay. Right. Sorry. The only thing that matters now is finding Ethan. Imagine being trapped down there. Or actually, don't. Yeah. Last thing we need is getting trapped in here. What happened here? Massive cave-in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. Legend. Ah. Yeah, That's why everyone Jed thinks he's a hero yeah, Jed. legend. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Or they silenced him by huh. buying him the Black Lantern. Yep. It's the same door, isn't it? From same the comic. Logo. Yeah. Okay. Okay. If the wall is an illusion. Tunnel. Yeah, okay. Find another way in. Zombie, right? The zombie that was sitting over there by the campfire. Blood flow. Into there. Hollow. Crawl. The, there's a door that opens up, right? Okay, okay, hold on. Then we can find a way in. Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds yes. like the mind to me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. Watchtower, right there. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower, that's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. It's probably easy to open. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look then. Gotta, you know, make okay. up for my mistakes, you know. His comic on this place. Maybe I should compare his drawings with other stuff in the area. Uh, compare. Went a different way. Yeah. Let's see. 
Gabe has a new. Alex. Okay, uh, never mind. It's the same. You... No point in blaming anyone. We just gotta find him fast. Uh, speak. Let me know if you find anything. Yeah. Um. This might be it, cause actually it looks like he's cracking open a door or a gate. Wait, so did Ethan? Oh man. Yeah, he went through there. Just open it. I think there's like a side door back there. I don't know. I can guess there might be. Give me a hand. Open Sesame Street. <sighs> Yo, how did he open that if it requires that many people to open it? Two adults, or rather one young adult and one adult. You figured that out from a comic book. Let's go. What about Gabe? Is he still going to get stuck at the door? Oh dear. Oh dear. Gotta look at the comic book again. Ethan. Oh shit. Sorry. Ah, no, I missed the dialogue. Whatever. Graffiti. I got some good news for you. Phone? And? Ooh, new memory okay. unlocked. I'm sorry to call you at work. I just came home from the doctor. I couldn't wait for you to come home. Baby doll? I, I'm pregnant, Jed. With Ryan, right? Surely. Alright, let's look at the comic again. So, walks in. There's this it's tall scaffolding. Serpent through the wall, right? I think that's the... Yeah, we just gotta go up then. What? The red one. Go with red! It's always red. Kinda wanna push all the buttons. Also... Kind of scared to push any of the buttons. The problem is we don't have uh, rewinding abilities like Max Caulfield. So if someone dies, they're dead. Um. Okay, so we need to look at the comic. He goes upstairs, right? So this must be it. These set of stairs right here are the answer. Yeah. Ethan must have gone upstairs. Pretty sure Ethan climbed the... Yep. Sorry, I keep cutting. I don't know. Like, I, I'm rushing through stuff. Because I want to save this kid rapidly. I'll try to be more cautious at the next um, cutscene. Alright, we're up. Sign Caution when ascending to top level cutwalk. Like an hour ago. True. Alright, let's take a look at the comic. You go, I can't find the entrance. Goes upstairs, your flying days are over Cloud Serpent. So that is the conveyor belt system, this one. So this place was a death trap when it was operational too. St cool. Hmm. Standing cool, cool. on or riding a moving conveyor belt can result in injury or death. Typhon mining is not legally liable for the medical costs incurred by employees who use conveyor belts improperly. Okay. So I think got to keep going up because this was the top layer and then he says you crowd this one he rode the serpent thing oh yikes uh, Rooney's Not in the comic okay so we can start comparing but now he goes through something this serpent this one this conveyor belt that's what he went on because that's the serpent right the skeleton How did he get there though? Did he shimmy his way up there? Because it's literally- the he jumped! Yo, the kid has guts, man. Went to the next building and then he- okay. Yikes. Ethan made the 
jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. I think I'll find another way through. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes. Yep. Yikes, indeed. Let's use it. All right, so that door opens up. Then we can walk over, I guess. Yeah, turns out you gotta open it. Who knew? All right, we're out. Okay, so we go out through here, I guess. I think I saw dead crow. Ugh. Let's hope yeah. omens aren't really a thing. Okay. We're out of here. Mattress, who's been sleeping here? Ugh. Worse than sleeping on the ground. Compare? Nope. Thanor doesn't battle any bed bugs. <laughs> Jokes. Anyway, let's ke get a move on. C coveralls. So much stuff just left behind. Indeed. Circuit box. Door control. This thing has seen better days. Free hugs, apparently. Thanks for nothing, giant yellow button. Okay, let's leave. Gotta quickly make our way. Whoa, Gabe's already there. What took you so long? You never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Good to know, Gabe. We have a child missing right now. Come on. We're too nice, Alex. Gotta follow the path. Follow the uh, conveyor belt. So into there, yeah. Right? You gotta go in there because he's at the top right now. Thanor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. We can just... There. That's where he's heading. That's by the ravine. Shit. That's Let's where go. they're exploding it, aren't they? That's where the That's the area they're detonating. Better hurry. Better hurry. Get to the kid fast. Close? I think so. Ethan! Come on, Ethan, Ethan just show Ethan. yourself. Oh, she's feeling the aura, maybe. Oh my god, kid, what have you done? Ethan! Alex! I'm scared! Yikes. Ethan, I'm coming for you, buddy! Wait. Hold on. Ethan? You okay? Yo, bro. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. Just hang on. Yo, out of all places you could have gone, you went over that? Don't. Don't, 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 don't. His fear is so strong. If I get near it... Oh, yoy, yoy. It's no good. We're too heavy. Oh, no. It's going to be left to Shit. Alex. What about me? Alex. Uh, are you sure? Yeesh. You gotta call the rescue people, no? Or bring equipment. Ask the mining company to come help, you know? Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Awesome. Show me. Ooh. He forgot! No, I'm just kidding. He's probably more worried about sending Alex over. You okay? 
I'll do it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm all right. He I'm did sure. mention anxiety is okay, noise no. never. No, I'm good. Good to have in these situations. No. Freaking out. I actually believe you when you say that. Alex, can you make eye contact with me? Do it. I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum. The feed rope, your direction. Follow? So far. Awesome. You're doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. Oh no, it's gonna be a fast time event. Steady. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gotta be ready. Gotta be ready. Piece of cake. A cake that's hard to bake. Uh, You're gonna make me do quick time events, aren't you? Hang on, Ethan. I'm coming. Oh. You got this, Alex. Slow is steady. Slow and steady. No. Not without you. I'm not going back without you. You're stuck with me till we're both safe. <sighs> this is tense. Real close. Just a little further. What was Ethan thinking? Hey, Ethan? I'm here to help, okay? What is wrong with this kid? Oh no. It's too much. I have to get him to chill out. Uh talk about the comic. That's an easy thing, right? Ethan, I need you to calm down. Can you breathe for me? I should never have come out here. I was so stupid. Okay, hey, hey focus. Talk to me. You want to tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. A log fell. That's fine. That's okay. Let's talk about what comes next. Gabe is our anchor. Gabe's got us. We're not going to fall. He's got the other end of the rope. No, I can't move if I move. You're not going to fall, buddy. It doesn't matter. Oh, wrong choice of words. He's not making any sense. I need to talk about to the comic. Down. I feel like that's We can't stay here, Ethan. We have to it'll see me. Don't don't If I move, it'll see me. Whoa. He's going to see you. You don't understand. He has powers too, doesn't right. he? I don't. I can't help him if I don't understand what he's afraid of. Yeah. And the only way to understand is to feel what he's feeling. Oi. Oh, fuck. I can't believe this is happening. I can do this. I can do this. Stay perfectly still, girl. Oi, ve. I have no clue either. It's like I'm seeing the world through his Whoa. eyes. What is all this? I Claws? I thought I could hurt the monster, but it's hurting me. Oh. I'm not just feeling what Ethan feels. I'm seeing the world like he sees it. Whoa. That's intense. I brought all this I stuff. Brought all this stuff. None of it will None save me. Interesting. I'm bored and wouldn't be afraid, but he's just a story. This is real. Okay. 
He's not afraid of the fall. He's afraid of the monster. That's pretty cool. Cool effect. How do we get out of this icky situation? Oh, but it looks pretty fucking real. The human imagination is pretty intense, you know. I see it too, Ethan. The monster? I see it too. And I'm just as scared as you are. But Ethan, we're safe. You know why? That thing can't see us. It can't see me. Of vanishing, just like my thwarted. I thought that was just a story. Hell, no. some stories are true, like monsters. So, you're gonna hold my hand, all right? As long as you're touching me, you're safe. Is that how the story goes? Maybe. Come on, take a leap of faith, buddy. The monsters in your head aren't real. Yo, you're gonna leave Don't all your down, stuff okay? behind? We'll be done before you know it. Um, maybe the best idea was for you to ask him to hold on to your pants or like your sweater. Keep tight on the bullet, Gabe. Not over yet. Oh okay. I gotta Okay. One step at a time. Good, look up. Don't look down. Never look down. Yes. Yeah, buddy. I'm still really scared. Uh. There's nothing to be afraid of. I got you. But what if you let go? I won't. Oh, shit. Do you think the log will break? Uh. I've got you. I don't know. Maybe that's a wrong answer. If it does. I am gonna hold on to you so tight. Okay. Okay. So far, so good. So tense. Even my hands are getting sweaty, man. That's intense. You're almost there. We're 60% of the way through. Come on. Oh, something's bound to- Uh, shh. Nikes. Hold on to the dude. Thank the Lord. Look up. We are close, but that log ain't looking too stable. That's it. Come on. There you go. We did it. Yay. <laughs> Is there a way to fail that? Yikes. <laughs> Made it. Uh oh. They're blowing the place up. They're early, they're early. Get the heck out of there. Oy ve. Yo, there's still humans up there, man. Oh, shit. Whoa, she's still tied, she's still tied, she's still tied. No! <laughs> what did I say? I knew this was gonna happen. Yo.
Yo. That was it. That was it. That was the chapter. All right. Alex told Gabe about Ethan's plans. Alex kept Ethan's plans to herself. Oh, I'm split between that 50-50. Almost. Alex told Riley the truth about the fight. Alex stayed out of Mac and Riley's fight. Ooh, I was in the minority there. Alex told Gabe about her power. I was in the majority there. Uh, Alex told Gabe about growing up in foster care. Okay. Alex hugged Gabe on the bridge. I mean, of course, I'm sure a lot of people did. Uh, Alex encouraged Riley to be honest in their interview. I think a lot of people have had interviews in their lives before. Alex put cool sunglasses on the gnome. Alex enjoyed a song on the record store, didn't stop at the listening station. I mean, I did, but I didn't want to get copyright music on. Alex told Ryan that Gabe was a dork. That's a 50-50. Uh, Alex rocked out with Gabe on the broom guitar, 96%. Um. Huh. There. So I guess the dialogue interaction could um, put you in a minority there. Alex found evidence of Gabe's search for her. Some people didn't check. Okay. Alex wasn't sure how she felt about Haven. Thirty-eight percent expressed optimism to Charlotte, pessimism to Charlotte. Okay. Alex told Jed she's never been a server. Honesty. Okay. Alex told Gabe she loves the guitar. Ninety-seven. Yeah, that's what I was expecting from everyone. Jed was impressed with Alex's performance as a server. Jed was not impressed. Um, figured out Alex has never... Oh, so if you lied, I guess you could end up with that. But he was impressed because I remembered Mushroom on the burger, his usual rye whiskey, and then the girl had the special pie with the fries. Steph beat Alex in the jukebox game. Yeah. Oh, some people got it. Okay. Riley and Mac are still together. 27% Riley broke up with Mac. Oh, okay. Ducky was reunited with his favorite whiskey. Most people got that one. All right. Uh, I don't have any friends. Next chapter or it's the main menu. So, yeah, that's it for this video. I've been going on for two hours now with this recording. So, it's a prob probably like a one hour and 40 minute episode. Next time, I'm just going to upload the full chapter since I didn't know this was going to be a thing. I thought it was just going to be one big movie type game but yeah it seems like there are chapters i was bamboozled by the internet once more but yeah that is it for today's episode chapter one is done that is one intense end to the chapter hope you guys enjoyed if you did please leave a like subscribe use the red button down below and hit the notification bell as well so you're notified when the next episode of life is strange goes up this is an intense series the storyline has been insane so far a slow burn but at the end that was a huge cliffhanger so hopefully you guys will be tuning in tomorrow when the next episode or as soon as you guys hit an insane amount of likes i'll upload the next one when i play it of course comment down below what your most intense moment was of this game and as always please take care of yourselves stay healthy stay safe and i'll see you guys in the next video take care last year we bought a house outside of boulder Oh, how Kathy always missed that Rocky Mountain sky. She said, let's move before my folks get any older.